Some UNC alumni have dreams of graduate school or Wall Street. Emily Kennard and Kelly Lynch show us one former UNC history major who's brewing what he learned in school into something unique. Holly, you can see connections to UNC everywhere. <coughs> you just have to look closely. Each beer at Big Boss is named after a World War II fighter jet. The connection to Carolina, owner Jeff Lamb. He graduated from UNC in 1990 with a history degree. At Big Boss, he can combine his love for history, North Carolina, and beer. I think that, you know, I mean, UNC is a, I think it's a great college. I mean, I had a blast there. Um, and I think that there is definitely you know, that's probably when I got, you know, sort of bitten by the beer bug. Each beer's name and label is displayed on panels designed by local artist Scott Pridgen. However, Lamb said he was never able to combine his interests of beer and history while at school. Modern European history was my uh, specialty, so no, I never had to write a paper on that, but it would have been interesting if I had actually done that. I probably, you know, either would have got an A or an F. In addition to hiring local artists, Big Boss also uses local ingredients and even incorporates fresh plants, which grow outside the brewery. This is what attracts loyal customers like Neil Zipser. Outstanding local beer. The brown ale, brown ale is outstanding beer as well as their seasonal to harvest time. Big Boss opened in 2006 and is located in North Raleigh. Until next time, it's Emily and Kelly. And remember, every, every good beer has a good story. Cheers. And cheers to you. That does it for this edition of Carolina Week. Thanks for watching. Good night.